Hi everyone, welcome. This is the Oily Cadence. My name is David Ingram and I'm here with Bo Edisted from hey, Tech buddy. Shed Co. And we're doing a special men's edition on the Cadence today. You sure so are. So I'm pretty excited about this, too. man. I am too. So been looking forward to this one for a while actually. <laughs> so. Yeah, yeah, me, me too. We got a lot of exciting topics we're talking about today. We're talking about oils, we're talking about men's yeah. products. I mean, there's oils out there for guys. I mean, obviously there is. We just then that's what we're here to talk about. We're going to talk about some of the different oils that are here, um, some of the little things that you can use. Yes. Um, I don't know if you remember, but a couple of weeks ago, uh, Gina had a beard oil, and I put it on. And as you can tell, it's no shave November. Yes. Yes. And and, and it's right there. there it is, right there. And we're going to uh, talk about some of those oils and what they. Uh, what they do for you. So David, why don't you go ahead and... All right, so we'll start this start this out today. Um, so a couple weeks ago, mm -hmm. you and Gina talked about um, endocrine disruptors on the oily cadence. Mm -hmm. I don't know if y'all remember that. If you don't, you can go back to uh, the previous um, episode where we talked about that on endocrine disruptors. So, and as you mentioned, oils aren't just for women, okay? Oils are for men, actually a ton of oils are just specifically for men but a lot of them are also for men and women yeah and so that's that's the interesting part and something else i'd like to point out is that oils don't just smell good nice okay mm -hmm. oils are really good for your body too yeah. so as we're talking about um endocrine disruptors before we're talking about oils um hormone imbalance hormonal imbalance you've yeah. heard that well, before we've right we've talk, we talked about that yep, yeah yep, we, we talked about that so well a lot of times you hear about that in women. Yeah. You know, you hear about, you know, especially menopause, mm -hmm. especially, you know, mm -hmm. monthly cycles, you know, hormones go up and down and out of whack. Oh, crazy. Well, sort of stuff. what a lot of people might not realize is men have unbalanced hormones too. Okay. Yes, they can. They can definitely have... I mean, I guess, I guess it's possible if it's good for women, it could be for men as well. Okay, so men can have unbalanced hormones as well. Okay, so... We're gonna before we jump into oils, let's talk about chemistry. Okay. okay. Some chemistry. Did you uh you take any chemistry classes in, in your school school time at all? I mean it was it was some, not a whole lot though. I mainly focused on uh, anatomy, oh, human yeah. physiology yep. and stuff like that. Yep. I, I didn't do too much of the chemistry. Yeah, well see when I was in school it was either you took you took chemistry or you took anatomy. They didn't let you take either one, you know? So it's like, oh, okay. So I took chemistry, you took anatomy. Yeah. So then, then we got two different viewpoints going on. Absolutely. Here. So we're going to bring up something called cisquiterpenes. 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 You're probably asking what those are. Yes, I am. Okay. I'm, I'm trying to figure it out. Um, just briefly, we're not going to go into chemistry two class today, but just briefly, <laughs> uh, cisquiterpenes are a compound with 15 carbons. Okay. Okay. They're similar to alkanes, and forgive me if I mispronounce some of these things, okay? Mm -hmm. And monoterpenes. So they're similar to those. So if you're a research buff, you like to dig things out, you can you can look that up as well. There's actually 3,000 different cisquiterpenes that are found in essential oils. 3,000. 3,000. Now, why is that important? I don't know. You tell me. to tell you. <laughs> I was going to say, I, I, I didn't take this class. Don't know. <laughs> so, um, so, many cisquiterpenes are specifically um, in, like, one type of essential oil. Right, right. Okay. okay. So, so there's, um, like, cisquiterpenes that are only related to a certain kind of oil. And okay. thus, there's three different thousand kinds of those. And some have multiple cisquiterpenes, you know, and stuff like that. So, they're all over the place. Well, cisquiterpenes are soothing to inflamed tissue and can produce effects, on, pro, profound effects on emotions and hormone balance. Really? Really. 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 Now, this plays an important role, not even, not, not just in women, but also in men and both sexes. Yeah, I mean, obviously. So, yeah. I mean... You know, so we're talking about oils for men, we're talking about oils for women, but something you have to remember is, like I mentioned earlier, is so many oils are versatile for men and women. Right. And right. they don't just smell good, they do something good for your body. Yeah. Okay, so now that we're done with the chemistry part, you can just remember <laughs> cisquiterpenes are awesome. They're good for hormone balance, supporting hormones, and supporting healthy emotions. So now we're going to talk about 
One of my favorite oils, Mister. Mister. Yes. Okay. So, do we have it here? Or yes, we know? do have it here. This this guy right here. I don't know if they can see that or Let not. Let me get it up on this camera here. And he said it was Mister. Mister. Okay. And what what? What is Mr. if I may ask? Okay, so Mr. Um, was formulated as a blend for for primarily men. Okay. But um, men more um, in their 30s and over 30. Okay. okay. It consists of sage, fennel, lavender, myrtle, yarrow, peppermint. Um, or myrtle. <laughs> I just had to say it. <laughs> I just, just had, had to say it. I just had to say it. Wait, that's okay. We're, we're talking about... We're talking about Men's oils. Yes. Yeah, so, okay. Hey, hey. So, um, so this this is what's really awesome when you do the research and you look into it. Um, it can really support prostate and male hormone health. Okay. Okay. So. so, so what I mean by supporting the prostate, we're talking about supporting the decongestion of the prostate. Yeah. Supporting prostate health. Yeah. So you talk about men that are getting older. Yeah. A lot of issues can arise in the prostate area. Yeah. So I yeah. mean that's that's a really good oil to support that. Okay, also... Something for you guys to remember. Yes. Also, this is one of those can go both ways oils, okay? Women can use it too. Really? Yes. Generally, it's normally women over 30, same thing. Hormones start changing, you start getting into to menopause, you got that sage in there and that fennel that really supports. Sage is beneficial for hormonal health. Fennel supports hormones and the digestive system, by the way. Just throwing that in there. And lavender. We talked about lavender. Yep, we um, talked about with lavender. With Gina a couple, uh, couple episodes ago. It has over 200 diff- different compounds. Yeah. It's an all-around overall so oil. So, I mean, it, it, does, it does so much in there. Peppermint supports your liver and gland function. Very important. Prostate Very, yeah. glands. Yeah. Okay. Part of the, what else are glands okay. in the yeah. male system, you know? Yeah, good point. Good yep. point. And the way you're going to use this oil is you can diffuse it. Or you can um, apply it daily to VitaFlex points and the lower pelvis. Okay, what are VitaFlex points? Because okay. I don't think we've Gina's even really talked about some of that. No, um, VitaFlex points are certain points on your body that can, um, like, almost react or produce an effect on a certain specific part of your body. Which okay. we're gonna get in an episode all about VitaFlex points. So we're not going to dive too much yeah, into that today too much into because that, that is a very interesting topic and, and a lot of information there that we want to share with everybody. Yeah. So, so, um, so there you go. It's, and Mr. Support your system to be level headed and manly man. Yeah. You know, we talking mm. manly man. So, so that's, that's a great oil. It also smells good as a clone. A lot of men like to put it on. Yeah. As a clone. It smells very It's probably nice. a lot better for you than some of the other male clones. Well, because right? remember, oils do more than smell nice. Yeah. doing something for your body at the same time so yes definitely definitely a good deal so another one that that is one of my favorites is idaho blue spruce idaho blue spruce have you ever smelled that one i have not oh is it really really nice guys this this is an oil you need to have in your arsenal okay um it's harvested in the winter time this is a single oil so it's mm. just idaho blue spruce it supports healthy hormones big time Really? Okay. Why? Really? Why? It is very high in cisquiterpenes. Which is what we've been talking about. Yes. Okay, and what do cisquiterpenes do, Bo? Forgive me, I've been running all these different cameras. <laughs> <laughs> cisquiterpenes help uh, support the overall glands and, and the hormones. hormones inside of the yep. human body and stuff like that. So I have been listening. I've been listening. <laughs> I didn't do too, didn't do chemistry course, but I am listening. <laughs> Which healthy hormones make for healthy, healthy levels, levels, healthy body, healthy reproductive system. I mean, it just helps everything. I mean, everybody goes and get these happy pills and stuff like that, especially men nowadays. They get the antidepressants and they get so on and so forth. So, And, and to think about that, you could probably help control those situations based off of these oils would be absolutely phenomenal for men. Because I think if you, most men are like you, if you're like me, I hate pills. I just hate pills. I don't like medication. It yeah, just, just does, doesn't doesn't work for me i mean at first off i gotta remember that i gotta do it every morning having something like this of oils it could be a routine like in the morning i mean every guy puts on cologne or deodorant in the morning because obviously we don't want to smell like bo later <laughs> but yep. um uh you know 
taking a, a, a couple minutes to apply something like this uh, topically on top of our, our in the VitaFlex points would be uh, beneficial. I mean, absolutely phenomenal if someone could yes. jump up on something like this. So yes. yeah, I could see this big time. And 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 here's the you brought up a good point about just the routine of putting on your cologne. Yeah. Okay. Or putting on your deodorant. We talked about the endocrine disruptors. Right. Okay. Cologne. Mm-hmm. Is an endocrine disruptor. Which we've talked about last so, week. So, yeah. yeah. ditch and switch your cologne. Guys, get you some Idaho Blue Spruce or some one of my cedar favorites. Wood. Yeah, some cedar wood or some Shootron, which we're going to talk yeah. about in a minute. Yeah. Um, and put that on instead because not only are you going to smell great, you're going to feel great, and you're going to be supporting healthy hormones instead of disrupting them. Okay? Yeah, absolutely. So, that's... So that's awesome. And it also supports your body in regards to healthy cholesterol. Oh, okay. men struggle with that. That is a big man issue, actually, is cholesterol. Yes. I mean, that and blood pressure are probably some of the biggest ones, yes. which we're going to talk about a good blood pressure one in a couple of minutes. So mm-hmm. I'm looking forward to that one. Yes. Yeah, so, I mean, and, and, I, and I, keep, I keep bringing it up, but just oils are so beneficial yeah. for you. And it's more than just smelling nice. Yeah. You know, you're supporting your cholesterol levels I mean and it's also great to use before workouts or night out with the wife yeah absolutely yeah, throw throw on some Idaho blue before you go out with a date on your wife there's also um, DIY colognes that you can do and we're gonna share a share a post about that in the mm-hmm. notes as well about DIY colognes for men um, this is one that you want to go ahead and dilute a little bit if it's your first time using it with mm-hmm. a carrier oil okay like the v6 oil or or fractionated coconut oil just because it's a slightly hot oil this the uh, sutra or the no the idaho blue idaho stress. blue idaho blue yeah so it's a slightly warm oil so um it could give you a warming sensation so you'll want to make sure if it's your first time trying it you just dilute it a little bit with a carrier oil before you apply it okay okay, okay. absolutely and then of course diffuse to get a sense of balance and grounding okay and diffuse to get a sense of balance and yes ground. Yeah, so that's so that's um, an awesome one there. Okay, so is there any oils that you were interested in talking about <laughs> before I go to Shutron? <laughs> well, if you're someone like me and you're in the workforce a lot, uh, I work on computers, and I can be honest with you, sometimes the technology side can get pretty stressful and uh, overwhelming for me, especially if it's a very busy, busy day. So I use stress away. And, and and I cannot emphasize how awesome that oil is. I mean, you use it. I mean, I carry it in my pocket every day. Yeah, this bottle is all stressed out there because I'm carrying it. <laughs> it's it's had its fair usage, hasn't it? I can see that. Um, but uh, no, it's it's a, a wonderful oil. I use it all the time. Um, my wife uses it sometimes. She doesn't like it too much because it's kind of a manly smelling. You know, it's got a little bit of that manly uh, fragrance to it. And um, I use that all the time. Cedar wood, I use cedar wood all the time. I love the smell of wood. And can I be honest with you? It's kind of a guy thing, to be honest with you. Yep. That, that wood smell, something about it just kind of pulls you in and wants you to. I want to go out in the woods, woods and chop down trees, like, mm-hmm. you know. So uh, having that cedar wood oil, it sounds, it's so genuine and so real that I really, really enjoy it. And, and it's, uh, uh, I use that as a cologne. Um, I use. It's also very high in sequiterpenes. Yeah, really high in sequiterpenes. A lot of your wood oils are. Yeah, a lot of. That's, wood that's oil. why us men really like them, and it's almost like I don't know about you, but myself, I can feel myself like really wanting a certain oil like yeah. we've been you know young living's been out of idaho blue spruce for a while because they only harvest it in the winter and make sure that it's you know top quality. high quality so i've been really longing for that oil and we just got the northern lights black spruce now it's just like oh you know so your body knows what it needs yeah you know and so that's that's me i i you know crave some of those woodsy oils a lot of times and it's because of the cisquiterpenes in there yeah. you know it does support it, support your body it's wonderful it's wonderful so um Yep, so one of my probably all-time favorites, I'd probably say that about every oil, but, probably just about, just about. <laughs> but is the blend Shootron, okay? Shootron. It is made of Idaho Blue Spruce. Of course. Okay. Ylang Ylang, mm-hmm. Octia, Hinoki, Devana, Cedarwood. Ah, of course. Lavender, 
coriander, lemon, and northern lights black spruce, which we have in our diffuser right here as well. Just going, and it smells amazing. Okay, I mean, guys. It really does. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of <laughs> blown away by how it smells. It smells actually really nice and yes. nice and warm. Yeah, yes. I like it. I like it. Yes. A quick tip, if you want a great, just manly, woodsy fall smell in your diffuser, four drops northern lights black spruce, two drops of nutmeg, and one drop orange. I really like that, too, because, I mean, I never thought about adding nutmeg, something, you know, that's something you usually cook with, to end that, but that is really nice. Well, it's it's funny, one day we might get into it, but that's also a very good man oil. Ah, yes. nutmeg. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a very good man oil. We can, we'll we can, just, we'll we just leave that alone. Visit, visit that in another, that another episode sometime. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Of course, it went that way. <laughs> we uh, we like to have fun here on the on the oil cadence. So. Well, it's the first guy show. Yeah, right? if you're, yeah. Honestly, I mean, this is this is. I mean, great and this thing. is this is topics about guys. You Absolutely, know, this is oils for this guys. Is, this so. is what it's about. Now, you mentioned something earlier about Yangling on that Sutron. Mm -hmm. So, that that's a funny name. But mm -hmm. what is yangling? Okay, yangling -yang is actually flour. Okay, it's okay? so flour. And um, it's also referred to as the poor man's jasmine. Ah, okay. Because okay, so. jasmine, um, you know, back in you know ancient times and everything was used, you know, in especially in in Asian cultures. Yeah, was used in you know higher higher up, you know, with the, with the dynasties and the you know emperors and stuff like that, the royal family, you know, and yangling -yang was a very popular. Um, remedy for all kinds of all kinds of things. All kinds of things. So, well, um, I mean, jasmine. Sorry. Yeah, jasmine, jasmine. But ylang ylang has a lot of similar properties to jasmine, and it's a lot cheaper to produce. Oh, so that's where you can yep. afford it. Yeah. Like and so, note to self, um, guys, this is also a very good one for your ladies. Yes. So. Yes. You know, whenever it comes back in stock, I would suggest getting some of that. Um, it's very good for. Helping out women's hormones. Yeah. Okay. Giving that a little hormone balance going in play. Yeah. Um, but um, not only that, it's also good for men too. So they have some of that. Yeah, yeah. They as have well, some because of a lot of these well. oils are. I'm gonna uh, steal this. For this oh, yep. Got the got the Shitron I, I beard got, oil. I gotta have some of this because um, my beard is absolutely irritating me. And guys, for you who are wanting to know how to even apply something like this, you just put a little bit in your hand, a couple of drops, and just. Rub it on, and voila. Yep. You are much better. Yep, and it, it smells great, feels great all day. I actually put a little bit on. I shaved this morning, got a little bit of razor burn. Oh, yeah. You know, under under my beard here, so I put a little bit on this morning. It's probably and better than you taking some of the, that cooling gel stuff that they have yeah. for the beard. And yeah, whatnot. you know, all the chemicals and stuff in there, you know, that you absorb in your skin. And you you don't want any of that. And you your know? scars are already up. I mean, I don't know if you're like me, but after you use warm water, because it always feels a whole lot better, but some people... Those pores open up, and some of those become like a, a susceptor. And then they put all the aftershave Shave. on, yeah. and it's got all the chemicals in it, the yeah. extras, you know. And it's like, yeah, it might feel cooling, but what are you absorbing? What in are you absorbing? Skin? Especially you know? on, your, on your under your neck, so like you got your oat glands right there. I mean, they're, yeah. just, they're just ready yeah. to take whatever's in there. So. Yeah, and the and the oil, I, I find it lasts a lot longer than like aftershave. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. you know, so it moisturizes, absolutely. it soothes. And then and then it lasts throughout the day, so you're not you're not itching in ten minutes, you know. Yeah, you're not. So, you're not getting so that's that's enough. really awesome. So anyway, Shutron. I mentioned that long list of oils that it is. Okay, this is the clone to catch your lady's attention. <laughs> there you go. Okay, this Everybody is that. now now this is one of those oil blends that are strictly formulated for men. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. and it's formulated for the ladies. To like it, <laughs> to like it, to like it. And but but here's here's the kicker, okay? More than just smelling nice, why do they like it? That is okay. a good question. Here we go. More chemistry for you. Pheromones. Ah. Oh, Have you ever heard of okay. pheromones yes. before? Yes. Okay. Well, if you hunt or anything like that, you're gonna be <laughs> using little pheromones mm -hmm. and hormones to catch it. Pheromones are chemical messengers sent from one person to the other. They have a physical and emotional effects on people of opposite gender. Oh. So it is, th think about it this way, it is the natural aroma, if you will, or the natural, you know, silent messenger that, that our body sends off 
to to the opposite sex. Mm-hmm. Okay? okay. And yeah. then when when we you know that's how we attract our spouse. Yeah. You know, that's, I mean, it's the same way in nature. You know, and it's and it sends off the messages saying yeah. that animals are you know ready to mate. You know, yeah. it's the same. It's the same way it's in the nature. Same way. Yeah. So the way that God created us is we have that chemical connection mm-hmm. with our spouse. When you get mm-hmm. married, you know, and, and it's natural. Not to dive in too deep, but y- your pheromones with your spouse actually kind of connect a lot better yeah. after that. And they actually, when you use Shutron, it helps your pheromones to take on a more personal um, aroma mm-hmm. when you're using Shutron so mm-hmm. that, like, say there's there's a room of 10 men and they're all wearing Shutron and somebody's wife walks in yeah. that she's not like, which one's my husband, you know, yeah. in, in you know with the smell because it, it takes on a personal aroma yeah, just to, like, to boom, each boom, boom. to each different man because our bodies are all different so, yeah. it, so it makes our pheromones act differently okay and it also tri- triggers the hypothalamus which is part of the limbic system this is part of the limbic system we made sure. an episode on that so i mean all yeah. this ties together it's all right there and there. circles around you know this is one of the best ones for male hormone balance to support Sutron. healthy hormones is Shutron. Sutron. so we want to we want to make sure that we uh if anybody is interested in stuff like that that would probably be one of the best ones to get involved in for especially on the male side yes i mean that would be an excellent cologne replacement it would be an excellent uh, overall health um, same with Idaho Blue Spruce because you talked very deep in yes. that one. That one would be an excellent one as well. So, David, your wife is uh, kind of going to tie it in a little bit. Your wife, uh, she's, a, she's a distributor of this, and, yes. and you are as well, I, I, I guess. Mm-hmm. So, um, men, for you out there, if you are needing a way to get one of these, especially if you're wanting to do it in a way to... Um, especially coming up with the holidays and everything, and you're wanting to surprise your loved one with something like this, or if you're wanting to um, get uh, want some for yourself even for just Christmas, for those of you who aren't married and so on so forth, you need to contact David Ingram. Their email address is right there on the lower third. Just uh, hop in there, get stuff that you need to. Uh, this stuff is excellent. Yes. It is excellent. Yes. I mean, I can be on I can't stress that. Uh, deep enough. It is excellent stuff, and if you want to jump on this bag and, and this wagon train and get going, this is the best way to do it. I mean, it really is. And, and it doesn't matter if you're in, if you're in Miami or around the area. I mean, they can distribute it to wherever you need to go. They haul it shipped right to your address. Yep, and that's interesting. You know, you're talking about gifts. You're talking about maybe looking for for different um, products to replace. We talked about ditching and switching mm-hmm. ditching on the and cologne. Switching. Okay. The great thing is they've made Shootron available in multiple products. They've got the beard oil, which yeah. Bo just used earlier. They also have bar soap. Okay, yeah. They've got Shootron bar soap so you can start the day feeling fresh. Mm-hmm. Also, three-in-one body wash. Mm-hmm. I use that this morning, you know, just wash my hair, wash my face, you know. It's great. Start out the day smelling great. And then shave cream and also a specific aftershave lotion. Right. So they also have that available in the shoe tron. So great gift ideas. Or if you want to get something personal for yourself or your bathroom, you can start replacing one item at a time. You know, just when it runs out, buy the beer oil yep. instead. And when it runs out, buy the bar soap instead. Yep. You know, so that's that's just some great ideas to help easily and manageably switch from toxins in your bathroom yeah absolutely absolutely and you want us to switch out because just like when gina talked about uh with cleaning products over time your body just becomes a giant sponge and sucking up all these chemicals i mean in all the reality it just happens and it and for us men be honest with you it's kind of i can I, i'll be level headed with you guys it's sometimes we're just like ah whatever is the easiest and the quickest way of doing things you know just want to get done and over with Maybe setting it up to where your body is going to become more receptive of natural things rather than the chemical things, especially when you're starting out your day, is probably going to be one of the best things to do for your overall health. Routine. Routine. Just make it a routine. You know, in the morning, you put on your shirt, throw on your Idaho Blue or your yep. shoe on. Just get, you know. get this stuff, create a routine. I guarantee you're going to feel better. It's just like having a big breakfast versus a small breakfast in the morning. You have more strength to get through the day. That's right. 
That's so right. I've really enjoyed this time here. I really have, David. I think we should do this more often. A Definitely. Bit of guy moments, Definitely. guy times. Uh, we'll probably throw our own little spin name on it, <laughs> probably. But uh, uh, um, do you have anything else you wanted to throw out in here? Um, no, it, there's all kinds of, of oils that we could talk about today. Um, we have mentioned cedarwood. I will say we've mentioned valor before. Mm -hmm. That is that is great for for men and women. Yeah. You know, that's a great emotional and hormonal support. I'm not going to go too much into that because we need to wrap things up today. But, um, you know, take a look at the notes. Check out these oils. Check out Shutron. You're not going to be disappointed, guys. This not is a very very good Love. oil it's worth every penny and also the Shutron products they're great replacements in your home and ladies gift ideas Christmas is coming up your man you're doing yourself a favor yes by you, getting your you man some really, Shutron really are. getting some products for him been so. a little on the edge having some little issues there some I mean this, it, this it's, so, it, it helps everybody out yeah okay oh. so um, but anyway I think that's it thank you guys for joining us on the cadence today God bless you. Have a great day and join us next time um, with Gina and, and yeah, um, Gina. And hopefully we'll have another guys yes. chat session coming up here. I'm let us let us this. know if you enjoyed this guys session, and we'll be getting some more content out for you guys. Okay. All right. Awesome.